Hey guys, um, long time no see in a video where I'm actually talking, but I came home from college for Thanksgiving break to a wonderful package from Ami Ami that held the Mega House Gem Series Victor, and this is the first Victor figure that they have released, um, that anybody has released other than like the Q Pocket. Did I, is that what it's called? Q pocket one because I know that there is a Toy Works one and a Kotobukiya one. Kotobukiya one doesn't come out until December and Toy Works they just changed the freaking release date from November to March. So this is the first picture that I will have for a while um, and I really actually need to figure out like what the heck I'm gonna do with my display case because I definitely don't have room for like three new Victor figures. So I might make a video on my display case and all the things in my display case because I know like I have quite a bit more Victor stuff on the shelf than I've shown in any video. But yeah, so if you want to see that, just let me know. I also finished my Victor Eda bag. Well, a Victor Eda bag. I'm sure I'm going to make more. But if you would like to see a video on all of this, let me know as well. But I carried it around at in May Week in Atlanta and got so many compliments on it and I'm just like really happy with it. And Anyways, I am going to unbox the Victor Nikiforov Mega House Gem Series right now. I have one other Mega House figure and it is the Yato from Noragami figure, the one that like secondhand price went up so much because nobody's ever made another Yato figure. You know, based on that, and one of my dream figures is the Hisoka Mega House Gem Series figure, which has a really awful aftermarket price as well. So what I know about Mega House quality is a++. I know a lot of people were concerned about, I don't know, a lot of people had like opinions on this figure about how it was a cop out, that they chose the all black outfit, you know, blah blah blah, face isn't that great. I have loved every single photo that I've seen of this thing and I really like the fact that they've made a matching Yuri now, like definitely gonna need that. I mean, I would have probably bought it even if I didn't like it. Like the Toy Works figure, like I ordered that the face isn't that great, but like, the outfit though. You know, the outfit and the pose though, doesn't matter. It's Victor. Of course I'm gonna buy it. It's like if it's Levi, of course I'm gonna buy it. Anyways, let's get started on unboxing my husband. to figure out what to do with the box um, but I really hope you like this video um, if you were unsure about whether or not you should get this figure 
before watching this video, um, I would recommend doing it because it's beautiful. If you want to see more Yuri on Ice stuff um, and the occasional Levi from Attack on Titan, uh, be sure to subscribe. Hope you like this video. Hope you have a great day. Bye!